There is a bomb in Gilead to heal the sin sick soul. There is a bomb in Gilead to make the wounded whole. If you can't preach like Peter, teach. <laughs> if you cannot preach like Paul, you can tell the love of Jesus who died to save us all. Now there is a bomb in Gilead to heal the sin sick soul. There is a bomb in Gilead to make the wounded whole. Greetings from a kitchen garden somewhere in the world. Happen to be in the eastern shore of Virginia. This is a thank you to Dean Robert Willis of Canterbury, whose last day as Dean was today. And I've been watching his broadcast for the past almost two years every morning. And I can think of no better way to frame the day and I don't know what I'm going to do without his extemporaneous weaving of past, present, and future to engage my mind in such a way, things to think about, things to meditate upon, and anyway, it was just and is, is just the most rich experience of sound and sights. What a gift to humanity he will always be. And it has me thinking about how one might continue where he left off, if one even could. Um, I can't pretend to follow in his footsteps in any way. I do not have the breadth of poetic um, memory that he's been blessed with, but there is some overlap um, in terms of my love of the English canon and and the English way, right? But I did notice while watching his videos that there was, you know, or is a rather stark divide and that oftentimes what he speaks about is very remote and inaccessible for everyday people. I am everyday people. So there's that song, you know, and it's like where that song and Dean Robert Willis intersect is, is where I stand. Stand, stand, stand. <laughs> so the Lord is doing a new thing right now on the earth. No doubt about it. What no eye has seen what no ear has heard in the theater of the absurd. So, something new is happening for the birth of the church, the rebirth, rather, of the church. You know, it says in the church's one foundation, the lyric to that hymn, I believe, is, um, the church's one foundation is Jesus Christ, our Lord, she is his new creation by water and the word. So, you know, the church, or what the church has been calling itself church, is ready for a rebirth, you know, for something new to spring forth. Have you not heard? So we'll see where this um, kitchen garden reverie takes me. 
and um, many thanks. Great thanks to Dean Robert for his service of epic proportions. I will miss his morning prayer dearly and revisit them daily and hope to meet him some day on this pilgrim road. Love divine, all oh, loves excelling. Joy of heaven to earth come down. Mix in us thy humble dwelling. All thy faithful mercies crown. Ciao for now. Ciao Roberto. Grazie mille per tutti. Ciao.